It is my privilege, honor, and I'm actually humbled to be standing beside you at this moment because I remember that moment. Uh, I will never forget it, and I know you won't either, which excites me because I will forever be embedded in your mind. <laughs> Always. <laughs> Buddy, I love you, and I'm proud for you. Welcome to the Grand Ole Opry. Ladies and gentlemen, please make him welcome. Give him a round of applause. The newest member of the Grand Ole Opry. I have thought many, 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 many times what it would be like to have one of your friends come out and ask you to be a Grand Ole Opry member. And that happened on December 21st, 2018, Vince Gill. And then January 11th, one of my other good friends comes out and hands me my trophy, Craig. Man. I'm not going to tell them all the stupid stuff we did in Iraq and Afghanistan together. I'll just tell them that you are a hero of mine. This man served his country in the United States Army. He's a warrior. And I will forever uh, be indebted to you for welcoming me into the family. But I also want to thank Jeannie Seeley because the very first time I ever walked on this stage, I was introduced for the very first time by Jeannie Seeley. So the very first time I was ever introduced as an Opry member was by Jeannie Seeley. And that means a lot to me. That means a great deal to me. I'm so honored that you were here with us tonight. I got my mom and daddy. I don't know where they are. My mom and daddy are out here in the crowd somewhere. That's my mom and dad right there. My wife and my daughters, Mally, Macy, my wife, Kelly, are over here at the side of the stage. And I'm so grateful that y'all are here with me tonight. I'm doing my very best. I think I'm holding it together pretty well right now. But I have to, I have to throw something out to somebody that has absolutely no thought process that, that I was even going to thank them. And, that is my junior high chorus teacher who is here with me tonight. I was a 13-year-old kid who loved to sing, loved to sing. She cornered me one day and she goes, you should be in chorus. And that began my dream. And Suzanne, I don't know where you are. I've never called you Suzanne. I'm 45 years old. I've always called you Miss Woodruff. <laughs> but Miss Woodruff and her husband, Tim, are with us tonight. And I don't know where they are. They're right out here somewhere, too. Suzanne, I owe a great deal of who I am today because you believed in me. Thank you. Bring me George Jones's coat, please. I slept with my ACM the night I won it. I'm sleeping with this tonight. <laughs> I am honored to stand on this stage as the newest member of the Grand Ole Opry. Yeah. 